Hey y'all, it's your girl Shamaya and welcome back to another weekly vlog. If this is your first time seeing my face, I post, well, I try my best to post two times a week, Wednesday and Saturday. Wednesday is typically a weekly vlog. And then I try to post short form content on Saturdays. Please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. So today is Monday, February 5th, and it's currently 1.22 p.m. I actually took off a week of vlogging last week. Didn't vlog really, and it actually felt really good to be able to not vlog and still have stuff to post <laughs> twice a week. Cause if you've been with me since the beginning, you know that consistency has not been my strong suit. So the fact that I was able to not record and still post, that's a that's an accomplishment for me. But since I did not vlog, let me tell y'all about last week. Last week was a really good week for me. I, you know, went to all my classes, got all my work done by turning all my stuff in on time. Um, it was pretty much a regular week. I, you know, was spent, I've been spending time with Jalen and Amber. They've been included in my routine schedule and it's continued to stay that way. So that's nice. Thursday, I went and did field experience, which I actually was going to make a video. I show y'all what a day in the life of an elementary education major is like but I decided I'm gonna wait till next week to record that video just because it's my first first time of the semester doing field experience I didn't want to be caught up in trying to get content out of it so I scrapped that but went to an elementary school it was in a rural area so it was a school that needed a little bit of help and, or needs a little bit of help in my opinion I will say I feel like I learned more things about what I shouldn't do as an educator versus stuff that I should do not that any of the teachers that I met were bad teachers or anything it was just certain stuff that I personally picked up on that I was like yeah as a teacher I would make sure not to do this but it was a nice experience nonetheless because experience is field experience is field experience actually being able to get out in the field and shadow a teacher is a good thing regardless it wasn't just me who went it was me and four other people um that I had I had just met all of them no, I wasn't just meeting all of them for the first time, but it was my first time like having real conversations with all of them. And so that was nice. When we were all done with our field experience, we went over to Chipotle and we ate and chatted and that was nice. Thursday was a really good day. Friday, the only class that I have, it got canceled. So I stayed in my dorm all day until I went home for the weekend. On Friday, I think Friday was like a regular chill day. Didn't do anything at home besides, you know talk to the family saturday me my sister my mom and my grandma all went out to eat at ocean crab house and i'll insert the footage here flashback you like mussels that much you don't remember how they taste good not really but i didn't think that i don't remember them tasting extra special for me to want them every time i get it with my boys <laughs> Why don't you just wear your glasses? You always. Cause I don't want to. Like you can't see through your eyelashes. <laughs> Girl, you look like your daddy. I know. <laughs> I think I want crawfish, crab legs, shrimp. I try to put a hurt on my mind. She offered, and I'm the college student. She always needs something. She always taking you to the dollar store. She ain't always taking me nowhere. Never the know. dollar store. Is that something? <laughs> Don't put that up. <laughs> <laughs> now go ahead. How did you like it? <laughs> How did you like the uh, one out of ten? One out of ten? We'll never come back. Open that up for me. <laughs> <laughs> End of flashback. And then after Ocean Crab House, we were supposed to go to my uncle's house, but he never sent the address. So that was what it was. Um, and then Sunday, regular chill day, packed up all my stuff and packed up stuff that I had left before. Got that all here now. So that was last week and my weekend. So today, tell me why I woke up early. I woke up early, I took a shower, brushed my teeth, lotioned my body. It took forever to get my hair into this little crusty, dusty ponytail that won't even stay and doesn't look that good. 
to the point where it took me so long that I was I was rushing out of my room like the shuttle pulls off at 7 40 I didn't leave out of this door until 7 39 like what what um but a part of my routine has been catching breakfast with Amber and Jalen or either or depending on their schedule so I, I really didn't want to miss the shuttle because I was trying to make it to breakfast with Jalen and I rushed out and my room looks yeah I need to need to get it together one thing that I left out that I did yesterday was I did go shopping I didn't vlog that because actually I wanted to but I had packed up my camera and I would have had to dig for it so I was like forget it they've seen me shop at Walmart a million times there's nothing special at Walmart um so but anyways like I was saying this morning I was rushing my room looks a mess and also because I was rushing I left my camera so I didn't vlog the beginning of my day today of course and I really don't have much to do but I do have a meeting with my org at 6 p.m today i think i'm gonna just go ahead and use today as a content day since i i'm good on work it feels so good to be approaching school from a different angle this year and like kind of falling back in love with education because the whole reason that i want to part of the reason i want to become an educator is because i think education is important but i haven't been showing that my actions have not been showing that I think that education is important until this semester like I've really been showing myself that I think education is important so I'm really enjoying this semester a lot better than my last couple semesters oh I was saying that because it feels good to not have any work not be procrastinating on something like know that I have to do something and I'm just procrastinating on it and then I gotta, you know, rush to get it done because I work well under pressure. Mm -mm, not trying to purposefully have that this semester. But it feels good to be caught up on all my work and now I can really just use today as a content day. I don't have to worry about nothing else. Oh, I also made up a quiz today that I missed on Thursday because when when there's when we have field experience days, because we're there from eight AM till like three we get a note sent from the COE to our professors to let them know, hey, this student is out doing field experience, blah, blah, blah. My hairline looks like it's receding. So I also did make up a quiz today and I think I did pretty good on it. It was math, so. I don't know if I should record myself getting my room together because honestly, I don't think I'm gonna get it together right now. I think I'm about to make it look decent and actually put stuff where it's supposed to go later because like that, that's a lot yeah i think i'm gonna eat a salad watch a little youtube or some i'm gonna just be chilling until 5 15 that's when i gotta catch the shuttle for my meeting i'm gonna really just be chilling and making content until 5 15. vlog i'm so mad at myself right now i don't know what to do i went shopping yesterday right i got a big jug of tea usually the tea has a blue top on it just now to get out the fridge, I was like, oh, it has a red top. I wonder what that means. I look. I'm not drinking that. I'm not eating that. What? Now I have a gallon of tea that I don't drink. Oh my gosh. Two hours later. Hey vlog, it's much later. I most definitely crushed that salad and then fell asleep. And then miss the shuttle to make it to my meeting so but this is the first meeting that i've ever missed in all my time of being on eboard i've either left late i mean left early or maybe showed up a couple minutes late but i've always shown up this is the first time that i haven't been there and honestly i'm not tripping about the fact that i broke that streak the sleep was really winning today but because i fell asleep that means i didn't do anything content wise and i think i want to order some food to record a, a muk mukbang mukbang do a little like chit chat mukbang talking about stuff that's happened recently for example nikki and meg which i'm so tired i'm so tired of hearing about it and talking about it i think i need to start going to sleep earlier than 10 at this point because the way i be going to sleep at 10 and still don't be having the energy to get up 
early. I need to go to sleep earlier. Tomorrow my schedule is going to be a little bit different because my 12.30 class got cancelled. I'm not going to say I hate going to that class, but I don't feel like I'm learning anything in that class. And my teacher is kind of, he's a big personality. And I don't know if I've said this in a previous vlog, vlog but I've tried to switch out of his class and... I couldn't because it conflicted with my other classes so I just had to stick with him and it's not like I think his class is the worst ever I look forward to days where we don't have regular class or where he cancels class later tonight before I go to bed I'm gonna put my clothes together because tomorrow is professional dress day so I want to take out whatever professional clothes I'm gonna wear the next morning this one I got to get I know get so it's Tuesday my third class got canceled so I went to my first two classes I am dressed professionally but I'm cold so I'm about to change out of it y'all saw this stuff in the Shein haul if you watch that these are the pants that flare at the bottom with the white bodysuit and I have with some black flats in my seminar and education class we presented we presented our presentations my professor said i did good in math i got my quiz back i got a 93 i have a 93 on that assignment and then i have a hundred on the two other assignments that we've done so starting off really good <laughs> Hey vlog, I'm in the library now getting ready to get some work done of course but first I need to make a to-do list of everything that I want to get done today, tomorrow, so on and so forth. I really need to just spend my time in here trying to get my life together because it's a little out of order just I haven't been as uh orderly with things as I was at first so I want to get back on track with that and I tell y'all it is so cold outside I'm going to one of these days I'm going to get tested for anemia because the way that I be freezing in this weather and it's like it's one thing to be cold but my fingernails literally turn blue feet be going numb if I don't have shoes covering my feet all the way like when I had on my flats earlier my feet kept going numb so on Blackboard, typically, when you see your grade, where it says weighted total, that's your actual accurate grade. The grade under that is unweighed, mean, meaning that it has all of your grades in there and it just gives you a total of what your grade would be. But your weighted total is your accurate grade based off of how your teacher weighs each assignment. So if something is worth 15% of your grade, the weighted total is going to count that 15% but the other total is not. So with that being said, it says my actual total grade is 193 out of 200. But if you look at that weighted total, 28.95%. I was like, huh? We've only had four assignments. He's only put three in. So I'm like, Dr. Wynn, why do I have a 20 something percent? And he said it's because the other stuff isn't in there for the the weighing of the grades but i was like dang 
I'm over here getting the hundreds and nineties on things and you make got me thinking I'm failing somehow. But yeah, just wanted to throw that out there because I know that students get confused, especially when you're a freshman looking at both of those grades, like how is one passing? How is one failing? Your weighted total nine times out of 10. Well, let me say this. Your weighted total is accurate if your teacher set up Blackboard correctly. Ask your professor about it, number one. Number two, always pay attention to your weighted total and not your total because your total is not gonna be accurate, your weighted total is. I hope that the people who tune into my weekly vlogs every week, I hope that y'all actually enjoy it, enjoy them. I be feeling like y'all don't, not because the numbers don't show it, but because I'm never really doing anything different in my vlogs. My days are very much rinse and repeat. Hanging with my friends, going to the cab, going to the library, going to class. It's very rare. <laughs> that I'm doing something different. And I don't know if that's necessarily a good thing or a bad thing. I wish I had a more eventful life to vlog for y'all, but this is it. This is college, honestly, let's be real. College is very rinse and repeat. It's the same day over and over and over again. It really is. Everything that you did Tuesday is the same thing that you're gonna do Thursday. It's the same thing that you're gonna do next week. And the same with Monday, Wednesday, Friday. I thought that with us having Black 82 activities, there would be more to vlog, but I haven't attended a single event yet because I either haven't had time or I haven't been here. Like I went home the weekend that they did something. Yeah, let me know in the comments and let me specify. Dad, I'm not talking to you. Grandma Tracy, I'm not talking to you. Honestly, any of my family members, any of my, anybody who is blood related to me, don't answer this question in the comments, please. Cause I know that y'all are gonna wanna watch me regardless. Anybody else who's watching, if you've seen my other weekly vlogs or other videos in general, let me know what y'all like to see over and over. And, I, and honestly, let me know what you don't like to see over and over. If you don't like to see me in the library every single week, let me know because that gives me a lot less editing to do. I'm gonna I'm keep it I'm a keep it a buck. Let me know what you don't wanna see so I know what I don't have to record and edit later. Tell me that in the comments. What's it going to do? Oh, the Bentley. They get them. Ride the foot. I know people die for nothing. What's it going to do? Oh, the Bentley. They get them. Ride the whip. I know people. Different things that happen in schemes and packaging. In our one night for shows, I'm juggling. Roll in the ocean, my boat, I'm paddling. Shout out to fella, that's my bro, my family. Frozen trees. When it comes to money, I did concentrate. We got the new streets, you are not my mate. Okay, so I've taken all those tasks and broke them down into four different days. I'm going to start off with the stuff that's quick and easy to get out the way. And the very first thing on that list is um, signing up for the Career Expo. If you become a I'll be my people then go say I know one by, I know one guy, I know one baby. I want enjoy, I want to fly, I want buy a motor, I want build I still want to know. What's it going to be? Do I go? Or do you bend it? Think I live? Ride the bush? so my battery died and my other one was charging so i've done a decent amount since the last thing i recorded so i finished everything on my to-do list for today except editing because i don't have my sd card reader to upload the footage onto my laptop so i was like let me get a jump start on stuff this do the next couple days since I still have time in here and I have energy out of nowhere. So I finished everything that's due on the 7th for my human growth and development class. Did that. I had to split into two days, but just went ahead and finished it in one sitting. And right now I'm working on my math homework that's due on the 11th. I'm not going to finish it. I'm only going to go about halfway. And then after that, I'm gonna go ahead 
and leave up out of here. And I'm trying to decide if I want to get food because I kind of want to preserve what I have in my dorm because I can't come, excuse me, I can't come eat at the cafe on the weekends because of the meal plan that I have. I'm gonna see what my friends are up to and that'll determine what I do. If they're free and wanna go to the cafe, I'm gonna go to the cafe. If they're not free, I'm gonna get something from Subway. <laughs> Mission 274 Perkins. Perkins. <laughs> Shout out to the YouTube channel. Y'all will be seeing my face a lot more often now. And the, she was that. in a hole last semester. A hole is a it? Hole. Listen. I mean, that's Let accurate. Me. Listen. <laughs> last semester. Here you go. <laughs> last semester. Ate me up, to me. I walked through the valleys of hell. I was going through life. But anyhow, team. <laughs> on the side oh. that it was going to be four, four. in the pack. Four. For 98 cents. You get one. Six. But it's good I said it's teal. So we can't be too mad. But it's a nice, good, oily. Um, Shout out Sky V. Yes, yeah, so we teach the gloss. 10 out of 10 recommend. Get it is a big one, y'all. Look at this. <laughs> Like not you're more. more I hope y'all sell Britney like this for her campaign. Oh my gosh. <laughs>